Hey guys, it's me again. So sa video na to, I'll do a quick review dun sa pinaka latest of the number number pair Jordan, yung Air Jordan 34 Black Cat colorway. Uh, tapos mamaya naman makikita natin kung how it looks on, on the feet when when worn. Sa pair na to, ang dami talaga minor details na kapansin-pansin. Kaya nung shoelaces. Tapos yung Jumpman logo malapit sa pinky toes. Yung Roman number 34. Yung tunnel na tinatawag nila. Tapos yung Jumpman logo sa likod. Tunnel. and then yung Air Jordan sa other side layo na rin ang narating ng Air Jordan line uh, simula ng Jordan 1 noong 1985 now we're on the Air Jordan 34s at yung each numbered pair daming colorways at collaborations initially released noong September 25th of last year tapos nag-retail siya sa $180. Itong pair na to, regalo sa akin ng asawa ko nung Valentine's. Kasi alam niya, gusto ko yung how it looked. So nabili niya to sa Nike Park sa, sa podium for $8,545. Uh, I think on sale to ngayon sa Titan. Pero hindi ko lang sure kung sold out na sila. Kasi ang dami ng sizes na na-sold out sa, uh, sa Titan. Itong pair na to, not your typical basketball shoes. Very light siya. Yung material use, very breathable. Tapos dahil sa tunnel na tinatawag nila, kulang yung swelas, kaya mas gumaan. So yung back cushion offers a lot of support sa heels, ankles, and Achilles. Unfortunately, hindi to pwede, uh, hindi to para sa mga flat-footed people. So ako almost flat-footed, um, I felt discomfort sa, sa arch ng feet ko. So definitely will not play on them. Um, kasalanan ko kasi when I, uh, I shop for shoes, shop with my eyes, and not, you know, the way uh, a pair feels. They are good impact shoes, look great on camera, and looks awesome on the feet. Uh, pero dahil nga manipis yung material, pag naapakan ka ng kalaro mo, sure ball, masakit. In terms of traction naman, uh, okay na okay siya. Uh, and one last thing, pag suot nyo to, do not wear uh, manipis na medyas. Otherwise, uh, you'll get burns sa inyong uh, pinky toes.